the mysterious past of ancient Egypt, with all of its wondrous treasures and intriguing mysteries, never ceases to enthrall people all over the globe. Historians and researchers in Egypt have made astounding finds that have thrown insight into the intriguing civilization that flourished alongside the Nile. In this video, we will look into 10 of the most intriguing enigmatic recent findings from ancient Egypt. Each of these findings reveals new facets of history and leaves us wondering about the secrets that remain concealed underneath the grains of age. 10. Policies of Diplomacy from the Earliest Times there is oldest recorded evidence of foreign diplomacy in an array of roughly 400 clay carvings called the Amarna Letters. They were written by Egyptian scribes in the 14th century BC and depict letters from Egyptian pharaohs and their enemies. During opposing forces and sensitive talks between the authorities of the vicinity, these letters portray the real feelings of people that ensued. These documents also include the first examples of diplomatic regulations including norms and protocols for dealing with similar situations. These rules, generally called the Amarna structure, helped make equality even among nations. For almost two centuries, kings relied on this structure as they expanded their empires, and it helped keep harmony and order across warring cultures. In 1887, a trove of writings was uncovered for the first time. They provide an essential understanding of old world politics, some modern scholars think they need to be more recognized. 9. The Gold Tongues Mummies Since it was a prevalent practice, mummies were often interred with gold tongues throughout the Greco-Roman era. The ancient Egyptians thought that carrying out this ritual would assist the departed in their transition into heavenly creatures in the hereafter. At an excavation site in an old mausoleum close to Quesna, just to the north of Cairo, a group of researchers discovered many cases of a unique burial method. The graveyards also included a wide variety of burial items, such as chains, vases, and scarabs made of gold. Along with the golden-tongued corpses, the search party discovered eight marble burial masks from the Greek and Roman periods. These headgear were meticulously carved to look like those who once wore them. 8. An absolutely normal gymnasium. Researchers have excavated a typical gym, the very first of its kind to be found. The Greek-style gymnasium sits on the outskirts of the sleepy hamlet of Wafta. The initial community was established in the 2nd century BC, while Egypt continued to be governed by Ptolemy's descendants. This period saw the merging of Greek and Egyptian aesthetics. The ancient Greek gymnasium was a meeting place for mentees, and their seniors for physical training and socializing. Fitness and health aside, it played a critical role in introducing young men to an army lifestyle. But people developed a passion for leisure after the Greeks acquired control of Egypt. In addition to the workout location, archeologists found evidence of a bathhouse at the 2300-year-old gym. It's interesting since it demonstrates how the Greeks assimilated many Egyptian cultural practices during their occupation. They preferred including bath facilities and large clubs where young men might exercise. 7. The cheese with the longest known history. Researchers in Saqqara, Egypt, unearthed an old item when the globe grieved its sorrow that they were not permitted to sip the juice from the sarcophagus. The discovery was the universe's earliest reported hard cheese. According to the results of a protein study, the white fluffy product that was 3,300 years old was probably a cheese manufactured from a combination of dairy milk and perhaps goat's or sheep's milk. The cheese was discovered in the burial chamber of a minister who assisted the pharaoh. The experts issued an alert that the cheese had the potential to be filled with alive microbes that could make anyone ill if they ventured to try it and eat it. 6. An idol made of pink granite, a small limestone sphinx, and a representation of the Emperor Ramses, I.I. carved from pink granite were unearthed some time before. The Egyptian Ministry of Antiquities has declared the pink sculpture to be an extremely unusual find. These relics were discovered in a person's garden when he was detained for illicit treasure digging around the Giza pyramids west of Cairo. The 1.8 by 3.5 foot sculpture 
is one of the first to be uncovered and built entirely of granite. As a symbol of the ruler's power and vigor, it features a pictograph reading Vigorous Bull on its backside. The statue was hoped to serve as a final home for the deceased's vital energy or soul. The 19th reign of Egypt was controlled by a man who went by the name Ramses I.E. He governed from 1279 BC to 1213 BC. 5. The Strange Carnivorous Monster A group of Egyptian fossil hunters has unearthed an extinct dinosaur in the country's desert that resembles the feared Tyrannosaurus rex. Several sources claim that the dinosaur remains were discovered in the remote Egyptian oasis of Bahariya. This unknown carnivore's relic was discovered amid iron and dust sediments. It required decades of research to determine which type of dinosaur the skeleton was related to and what the bone was. It was later determined that the bone in question was the 10th cervical vertebrae of a giant carnivorous dinosaur that belonged to the dinosaur species. The relic was given the original moniker in honor of the Argentine paleontologist Roberto Abel. But what sets this monster apart is its sheer terrifyingness. These dinosaurs resembled scarier, ruder renditions of the T-Rex, with teeth as pointy as shattered knife edges, and enormous limbs in the back legs that allowed them to spring forward and assault. 4. The Punishment Town the prehistoric town of Rhinocolura was supposedly termed for the destroyed faces of its occupants, and it was constructed near present-day Gaza, approximately 3,000 years old. As part of their illegal penalty, their noses were cut off before they were brought there. Inmates were confined to the city for the rest of their lives, turning the town into an actual jail enclave. The city was protected by soldiers stationed in structures as much as 66 feet above the ground. They kept a wary eye on the populace, even though they could easily spot a runaway inmate by their shattered nose. As documented by Greek authors, the settlement was supposedly created by Ethiopians who had their noses severed for attempting to attack Egypt. Despite the lack of proof for the existence of rhino cholera, amputating the nose was inevitably a typical punishment for unlawful conduct in ancient Egypt. Three. The record-keeping pads of the ancient period. The recent uncovering of the ancient metropolis of Athribis in central Egypt is a momentous occasion. From the start of the 20th century, when history started taking off, scholars have uncovered the greatest number of prehistoric notepads. Over 18,000 ancient Egyptian notebooks have been collected by scholars thus far. These are different from the notebooks you may purchase nowadays. Instead of paper, they were built of ceramic and employed in classrooms. Ostraca are broken bits of pottery used for note-taking in ancient times since they were less expensive and more attainable than papyrus. It's fascinating to see that kids were engaged in activities hundreds of centuries ago. There are more connection points between us and the ancient Egyptians than you might think. 2. Birthmarks that offer protection. Ancient Egyptian women often had tattoos to stay safe throughout labor. Archaeologists found six instances of this method while researching mummies that had been preserved at Deir el Medina, a historical site on the Nile River's shores. Because the skin must be kept, and researchers maintain a habit of not opening mummies, discovering historic tattoos is infrequent. But in this instance, parts of the corpses were made visible, notably the lower abdomen of a woman whose old ink bore a representation of the god bees who was believed to guard women when they were giving delivery. 1. The Ancient Egyptian Use of Egg Ovens The Egyptian egg burner has been called by certain scholars the greatest technical achievement of ancient Egypt. The Egyptian egg oven is an oven that was used to mature eggs in ancient times. The fact that it has altered so little in the intervening two millennia is nearly as remarkable as it continues to operate in rural Egypt, where it was originally designed. After seeing one and marveling at its inventiveness, Aristotle first describes an Egyptian egg oven. He saw an Egyptian clay oven used as an egg incubator where the eggs were heated and humidified, like that of a nursing hen, and where a single guy moved them at where a single guy moved them at regular intervals. That's enough time for more than 4,500 fertilized eggs to emerge simultaneously. 
Even French travelers in the 1700s marveled at this extraordinary and ingenious invention. That's all for today. Do you want to find the next archaeological discovery? Then buy a metal detector at the International Detector Center? Do you love discovering history? If yes, then our channel is a treasure trove of knowledge, experiences, and discoveries. Now hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. You won't want to miss what's coming up.